Small number counts to 100. Small number is a five-year-old boy who gets into a lot of mischief. He lives with his grandma and his grandpa who patiently put up with his antics in a small settlement with seven teepees arranged in a circle. One day, small number wanders out into the woods and sees a beautiful black cat with a long white stripe down its back. Wanting to take the cat home to shoe grandma, he tries to catch it and learns that the black cat is really a skunk. Smelling strongly from the skunk spray, he runs home to grandma, who quickly takes him out to wash the smell off him. As hard as she scrubs him down, she can't quite get rid of all the bad smell. Grandma doesn't want small numbers spending time in her teepee until he smells better. So she decides to set him a task she thinks will take him a long time. She knew a small number can count to 100. She tells him to start at their teepee, which is right beside the entrance to the settlement at the east point of the circle, and to walk around the circle of teepees by first heading south. His task is to count the teepees going round and round until he can tell her which teepee he gets to when he reaches 100. Small number starts walking around the circle counting. He starts at one at his teepee. When he gets back there, he has counted to eight. When he gets to 15 and is back at his own teepee, he stops and sits down. He counts on his fingers for a while and then runs in to see his grandma and yells, it is Auntie Rena's teepee, which is one teepee south of his grandparents. Question, how did small number know that the 100 teepee is the one just south of his grandparents' teepee without actually counting them? Mm -hmm.